if it can be told outside there that despite visual impairment that anyone should be able to undergo the training that Ajira Digital is offering because for me it is a wonderful opportunity that the youth of Kenya should actually be able to undergo. So I think now the next thing that we need to do, uh, we need to add skills on a different specialized profile because I realize each and every one of us has a different uh, account. So at the Kilimanjaro Blind Trust, we've been having a digital training on the specific modules on profile creation and also the blue collar uh, module. Kilimanjaro Blind Trust Africa is a charitable trust. We work for inclusion of the visually impaired. So KBTA basically works with technology and innovation to deliver access to quality education through digital literacy and skills. And this is why this partnership with eMobilis is so important because we want that our youth, no matter what their level of ability, know and learn and acquire the skills that they need to join the workforce and to be able to contribute. What I've learned from Ajira Digital through KBTA is how to navigate through different websites, websites that you're able to earn, for example, JobGather and Upwork. And also I've increased my typing speed and I'm really grateful. It was a really informative session. We've been taken through the creation of the different accounts. For example, it's the Upwork. These skills, they're going to help me in ensuring that instead of just sitting there and waiting for an opportunity to come, I actually have something to put my hands on. I'm digitally literate. I can now tap on the digital space to earn something out of that. Okay, so when you talk about the profile creation, we try to ensure that your Facebook, your LinkedIn account are placing you in the right direction when it comes to the digital skills that are required and also marketing yourself. Uh, for the blue collar module, we try to ensure that the digitally enabled skills have been placed on the right space when it comes to the digital space, in that you can also market yourself with those skills and get to reach out to people who might be interested in giving you jobs that entail those skills. Uh, the experience so far with the Ajira training has been good. The trainer was meticulous in planning. The way she took us through the content, it was step by step, so it was easy to understand. And so far she has helped us open accounts in the online spaces. So at least I've gained the knowledge, I've created my profile, at least it's marketable. That is something that is a, is a takeaway from these sessions. So for one as a trainer to be able to take them through the trainings, First of all, you need the soft skills and you need to be very patient with them. Uh, the other thing, uh, when it comes to the practical bit of it, we have a software that is installed in the laptops, the audio software that helps them to listen through to what you're taking them through and they can be in a position to do it practically using their machines once they've gotten the information. Uh, I really enjoyed to train them. We were really was humbled because uh, some of the things that some of the students were really doing in class were really amazing uh, and also some of these students are totally gifted I would say so I believe with some of the digital skills that we passed through uh, that we passed over to them with Ajira digital trainings uh, skills that are going to place them in the D in the gig economy and also market them quite well and go out there and get to shine with their skills this is a partnership where the two organizations can learn from each other Till today, nobody really knows how much those who do not have sight are able to contribute to the world of technology. Nobody knows because we haven't really had people focusing on them and giving them what they need to bring them to their full potential. And this is why this partnership through the Ajira platform is so important. And where KBTA comes in is their knowledge and innovative approach to making this paradigm change that we're talking about. All this is Ajira Digital Program Inclusive Agenda, our main focus being on the Kenyan youth and also 70% on the young Kenyan woman and also focusing on the people living with different disability to empower them with digital skills so that they can fit in the gig economy. So for me, I would thank Ajira Digital for coming to actually take us through this kind of session. What I would tell people with disability, girls especially, is they should not feel undermined by people because you are visually impaired or maybe you have a disability, you cannot work or you're not, you're not capable of doing anything. I would tell them to believe in themselves. Join Ajira, you acquire digital skills which will be of great impact into your life.